What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Let's Play Star Fox. <laughs> Sector Z time. And screw this place. This is a nightmare. This is by far probably one of the hardest levels in the game. Your team is doing well, Fox. I hope you're taking good care of the Arlings. Go for Macbeth. Good luck. Yeah, no shit. We have to go there next anyway. Ah, I hate this view. So, ugh, I hit the wrong button. Trying to kamikaze me. There's actually a decent amount of enemies for as many obstacles as there are in this level. See, another kamikaze pilot. Get the fuck out of here. And I missed the bomb. Try not to miss bombs. You actually need them on this path. And uh, I don't use this, uh, save states when I'm playing this game. I have, I, I just don't like using them. I mean, I, I'd rather do it, you know, the right way, legit, what some people call it. So, uh, but I do edit out the failures because otherwise this video would be like 20 minutes long. <laughs> Literally, I, I totally screwed up on this level a lot. This has to be my, like, 50th attempt at this level. It's annoying. And it's not even the level itself, it's just this one part that the game's just kind of like, okay, well, here you go, try to get lucky, I guess. <laughs> we couldn't make it through, but let's see if you can. You'll see what I mean when we come up to it. Make sure you destroy these things, otherwise I'll just shoot at you and... Not fun! Not fun in the slightest. And, uh, my good friend is back. Uh, slow down. Yeah, he's... Not fun. Like, this whole entire level is just riddled with slow down if you're, I guess, playing it on an emulator. And uh, you can't see it, but it's... At some points it gets like two or three times as slow, and I actually had to restart my emulator. Uh, it's the one time I think I've save stated during this entire... Um, yeah, look at this! <laughs> look at this! They just kind of throw a bunch of obstacles in your way. And... But there's a problem to that, and I'll tell you in a sec, but I'm, I'm trying to save my friend here, and random blocks come out of nowhere, and just like, smack me upside the head and kill me, and that's not, that's not nice. So I edited it out, uh, my last death, it was the same exact thing basically, and yeah, they start you right here, without the shield that they gave you in the first place. So you have to navigate this without a shield, and it starts you in this view, even if you didn't uh, die in this view, and so you have to navigate through that in this really shitty view, and somehow I did it, and don't ask me how. But a thing to remember is that, uh, oh I remember I, I died because uh, I did that same exact thing. When you exit the view, you go straight into the middle of the screen, regardless of where you were. So if there's like a bunch of these things in the middle, and you hit the view screen, then you'll just fly right through all of them and die. And that's pretty much what happened. But we're at the boss already. And <laughs> as you can see, there's like three minutes left in this video. That's how long it took me to do this boss. Like literally, it maybe took six minutes of recording, or so to get to the boss and the rest like 14 was me just trying to beat it Mid. luckily they give you some health but uh, like I said I edited out a lot of this boss fight just because it took so long and you know what boss fight this is if you watched path one you know what boss this is yeah it's this one again when I got in here the first time, I was like, wait, what? You're not going to give me a new boss? You're just going to recycle this one? At least give me something new with it. And, uh, luckily they do. 
all the little like triangle nodes on the side. I think if you shoot them, they send out stuff. Maybe they just send it out randomly. Maybe when you shoot the actual things they're supposed to shoot. But they send out ships that try to kamikaze you. They also shoot at you. And so you have to be careful when barrel rolling in this place because you're really close to a wall. And you're close to the ceiling, you're close to the floor, you're close to those like fucking lightning field things. And it's very dangerous to, as you can see, I, I just hit my wing and because you're already at like halfway to vertical and I'm not even holding down anything. And it's just a pain in the ass. So, like in Route 1, you gotta shoot all these laser things, and it opens up the middle. And, uh... Yeah, like I just did here, and... Still got a ship over there shooting at me, and I say, screw it. I, I'm just gonna shoot a bomb, so it leaves me alone, and I'll just kill this thing. And... What? No! Look how much health the boss has! Bullshit. So after like 10-15 minutes of trying to shoot this last one, it just wouldn't register. I shoot a bomb, I didn't want to because I wanted to save it for the last two levels. I was like, screw it, I don't care anymore. And I shot it and it killed the boss too somehow. So I was like, alright, that's cool. <laughs> let's move on. Let's, uh, let's go to Macbeth. Fire planet from hell. Yeah, the next level is a fire planet. You don't get a Solaris or whatever the sun level one in 64 was, but you do get Macbeth. And uh, just look at that beauty. It is looking good. It's something that's not Sector Z, and that makes me happy. 82% not too shabby. I'm missing a wing, though. That boss fight would have gone so much better if I didn't have the crappy single laser. But that's in the past. Let's just move on to Macbeth, and we'll do that in the next part of Let's Play Star Fox. So we'll see you then.